no, no, you can't be serious. We need the credits. Fine, but not at that price. I am worth more than 2,000. <laughs> And welcome back guys, my name is Crossroads and today we are watching the fourth episode of the Bad Batch series and the episode name is Cornered and uh, yeah, you can find the rest of the episodes here on the playlist and let's get straight to the reaction. Let's go. Hide a floor. That's where we'll hide a floor. Hide? But I've been stuck on Camino my whole life. Can we explore? Well, we won't be doing either. We don't have enough fuel, and we are also entirely out of rations. We'll have to acquire these necessities on our own. We the closest planet is... Pantora. Well, Pantora it is. I think we have been here before also in Clone Wars, so... Just a minor calibration in fuel. <clears throat> Just need to scan your ship in. Are you sure about that? I suppose I could skip that step if I had some incentive. I think he means credits. Is that sufficient incentive? <laughs> Pleasure doing business with you. This is Raspar 6. Word on the channels is you're looking for a certain modified Omicron class. Oh! I Fennec. I think she was not in Clone Wars Season 7, so yeah, animation debut for Fennec. And based on the sound, she is actually voiced by uh, Ming herself. You stick out too much. Oh, and you don't? Not dressed like this. Yeah, Pantoran pe Pantorian people are the blue ones here, so. Like in the Avatar, <laughs> James Cameron's Avatar. Yeah. Things are changing quicker than I thought. Let's get what we came for and get out of here. The signature key should be embedded below the rear parallax inverter. Just tell me what to rip out. Well, start with that. If you're looking to sell something, how about your droid? Droid. Uh, he's a he's a military prototype. Hmm. Yeah, give me two thousand. Hmm. Give me a minute. No, no, no. You can't be serious. We need the credits. Fine, but not at that price. I am worth more than two thousand. <laughs> <laughs> Make it four thousand. Three. Deal. What? We'll have asked like ten thousand or something. Omega, fuck's sake. Hello there. <laughs> Casual. Hello there. <laughs> hey. Oh, and Fennec is here already. And she had a, I guess, bounty puck for Omega or something like that. <laughs> Omega. And Omega is missing again. Why isn't the, the series called Omega on the Run or something? <laughs> <laughs> you seem lost. I got separated from my friends. I can help with that. I beg your pardon. I am the droid in charge. Oh my. You're not a droid. I will report his deception at once. I'll take your complaint. Dear me. <laughs> well, how did he leave with the leave Echo with the blaster? How how did that how does that even happen? Are you a soldier? Not exactly. <laughs> well, not exactly. I'm a bounty I hunter. A to protect myself. The galaxy is a dangerous place to be on your own. I know. If you're alone, you should come with us. Oh no. <laughs> now that's the best offer I've had in a long time. Omega! Oh, there's one of my friends now. Oh, okay, it's not going. Omega? Step away from her. <laughs> Shoot out time. Hunter doesn't even have a blaster, that's not fair. Hunter! 
they trained. She's after the kid. Yeah, we'll see about that. Listen, I made a bit of noise out here. Get the ship ready to go. Well, it's not technically a ship at the moment. And unless you have a team of maintenance droids, it's going to be a while. I can help with that. Gear up, fellas. We're going into the field. Where do you think you're all going? Get back inside. You got me for a bargain. <laughs> Run for it. Guess they're maintenance pipes because they're so large, but there you are. <laughs> Get to the ship. I'll handle her. A wrecker hit his head again. Oh god. <laughs> Tuck and roll. I mean, one thing compared to this, the Clone Wars is that the whole animation style is so much better. Just shot there, okay. I mean, a bit reckless bound behind me or something, I would say. Yeah, that's the last explosive they had, yeah? Maybe they got rid of Fennec for now. This vessel is now operational. Thanks for the help, boys. They're all yours. Follow me. Why did they take the at least the Andromex and the chubby boy with them? <laughs> and away we go. But where now? I mean, now they have bounty hunter. I don't know if it's just Fennec or if, if there's more after them. Has to be a bounty hunter. Yeah. I mean, has to be the Kaminoans. Ah. Uh. No, wait. I, I tried to stop them. If they come back, you know how to contact me. Oh my god. The target got away. But I'll find her. And that's the episode. So, I feel like a filler episode. The story didn't. Well, it kind of went somewhere that we now know that somebody's after Omega. Like, so I think it has to be the Kaminoans. And we saw the debut of Fennec Shand on the timeline wise and, you know, on animation, I, I assume. And I remember her being on Clone Wars Season 7. So, yeah. I think this is first appearance for her. I guess we might see her also later on the episodes, but yeah. Um, oh my god, still, uh, I wouldn't say annoying kid, but still quite lost. Well, of course, it's understandable, and you know, but I still think that like when they're going out, they should have more people. Again, it's just Hunter and Omega, and then. Hunter gets knocked out or something and Omega gets lost, basically. Or other way, other way around or something like this. So Um It's a weird dynamic dynamic, but it's still the same from last episode. So it gets a bit repetitive, yeah, I guess is the word. Uh, but yeah, I think we are going somewhere with the wrecker's headache and now he seemed to be exhausted. For like running a few blocks and his head got uh, hit again and he got knocked out again so I think that that seems to be some kind of storyline going on here uh, yeah we didn't really see uh, 
well, we didn't see Crosshair or we didn't see the Empire in this one play a role. So it's I guess this was kind of encounter with uh, maybe Kamino once who sent Fennec to get Omega for whatever reason or if there's a reason I have missed it. But I mean, yeah, otherwise this was kind of a filler episode. You know, oh, we need food and place and we cannot go hide because we don't have food and anything else. So yeah, uh, so I guess... Next episode will fix that, or next episode will be like lost in space or something, so. Or getting attacked by. Hot clan or something. I some bullshit. Uh, I hope, hope not, because I like this series more and more the more I watch it. And I like the whole style, is like I said during the reaction, that I really like the style. It's much better than the Clone Wars. But it's. I think it looks more simplistic for uh, some reason. I guess it's maybe the higher uh, res- uh, resolution on the stuff, and so maybe that's the reason. I am not sure, but yeah. Uh, there's nothing going on now. With we have a crosshair going on. We have Camino and some bounty hunters. That's maybe third, and then we have Wrecker's head. Uh, I guess with the inhibitor chip, so he might turn for an episode. Because I think he's kind of, you know, this like buddy friend figure, so he doesn't really... <sighs> he doesn't really get removed from the show's main, you know, spotlight unless he dies. Which I kind of like Wrecker, so uh, I don't see that kind of happening, but also that's when it hits you the most when you don't see it happening, so... Like 99 on Clone Wars Season 3, it's like the first episodes of the season. It's like Episode 3, it's a Camino uh, return arc thing. Yeah, but yeah. I think that's it. You can see the next one here or in the end ending screen. And if you really like this, please hit the red subscribe button because that, but that would help a lot. But yeah. Uh, we will see you in the next reaction. Oh, yeah. See you there. Until then. Bye. <laughs>